All right, guys, one thing I forgot to show you were these two uh, Tyco trucks that I actually found at the flea market. Uh, these were 50 cents each, I believe. And um, you know, these are always a nice little investment if you could find them. Uh, these were in a die cast, like a matchbox, big bin that I was digging through. And um, these were a nice little find because these tend to resell pretty well, uh, the, regardless of the condition that they're in. Uh, these usually will resell anywhere from $15 to $25 on eBay. That's a real nice pickup when you consider the amount that you actually have to pay for shipping. So, not bad. Uh, okay, next thing is this Craigslist haul that I found. Um, very rarely do I find anything that says NASCAR on my local Craigslist. Uh, but um, yesterday I found one and I decided to give them a call. And, you know... Rightfully so, they were asking a lot of money for this. A lot of money in my terms is anything, you know, say over $40. Uh, they were asking, I believe, $85 for this entire collection. And I decided to call them because one of the cars caught my eye. This one right here, number 43, John Andretti. Uh, now, these are all 124th scale, I believe. And there's a few different companies here. Um... You know, I'm just getting into the uh, the die cast collecting, so I'm not really too sure on everything. But they're all pretty high quality cars. Um, some of them have hood and trunk that open. Some just a hood. Some nothing. Um, but what really caught my eye in this deal was not necessarily the cars, but the two Lucite cases that came along with it. Um, the Lucite cases are very, very expensive if you want to try and buy them for your own collection. And they have a pretty good resale um, ability on eBay. So this whole collection, I plan on getting my money back by just selling these Lucite cases. Um, I paid $50 for all these cars. And I, like I said, I believe there's 12. There's the 43 John Andretti. Um, the 8 of Dale Earnhardt Jr. And this one's pretty nice quality, the hood and the trunk both open up. And then I have number 5 of Terry Labonte. And again, the hood and the trunk open up. Uh, number 6 of Mark Martin. Um, this guy I believe, might be Johnny Benson, I'm not sure. The number 10 Pontiac, uh, the hood and trunk open up. Uh, number 12, Jeremy Mayfield. I've never heard of this car um, or this driver before. 19, uh, Bradford White, driven by Tom Hubert. And then the 28 of Kenny Irwin. And the hood opens on that one. Number 36 of, I believe it's Ken Schrader. Uh, number 32 of uh, Ricky Craven. Uh, number 94, Mr. Uh, Bill Elliott. And then the number 99 of then, I believe it was Jeff Burton. So, not a bad haul. This all costed me $50. And uh, the people were really great to work with and to uh, negotiate with. And I'm um, very excited about it. Uh, all these cars are up for trade. Um, or, you know, if you guys want to buy one, let me know. I'm going to hold on to them for a little bit and then I'm going to end up putting them on... Uh, on eBay just to try and get my money back but I am going to keep the number 43 and of course the 8 that is a sweet looking car both of them so all right thanks for watching